This is uh, from a series called Medicine. That's medicine with a question mark at the end. Um, it is made of individual beer bottle caps that are rolled into a cone, and it's made in the exact same way a traditional jingle dress is made. Uh, the jingle dress is a newer tradition. It started in the early 1900s by the Ojibwe tribe. Um, and the story goes that a man had a daughter who was sick, and he had a vision that if he took tobacco can lids and rolled them into cones and made them into an outfit and had her dance in it, then she would be healed. Uh, tobacco can lids were important because tobacco was a healing medicine for a lot of indigenous peoples. Um, so this dance became a healing dance. Uh, the story has it that the, the daughter danced in the dress and was miraculously healed. Um, so now it's become a, a pan-Indian tradition and you can see jingle dress dances at any powwow that you go to today. Um, alcohol is kind of the opposite of a healing medicine, so I'm offering this piece to people as a, a sign of hope and, and a way out of alcoholism towards something better, um, which is why I put them in doorways. Um, another reason that I put them in doorways is because it forces people to interact with them and the sound is one of the most amazing parts of a jingle dress and these sculptures. So by putting them in a doorway, it forces people to have to interact with them and you can hear the sounds that the jingles make. Um, this one is called MMIW, which stands for Missing and Murdered Indigenous Women. Um, so many women go missing from indigenous tribes, so this was kind of a, a way to honor them and that, that traumatic experience also leads a lot of people towards alcoholism, so it was important for me to make a piece about missing and murdered indigenous women. This was the first piece of the medicine series that I made, and the rainbow was really symbolic of that, that sign of hope and um, outlook for the future. This is Medicine Medicine Wheel, and it depicts a medicine wheel in the center of it. Each of these colors represents a different thing. Uh, one of them is spiritual, mental, uh, physical, and emotional well-being. Um, a lot of Native peoples try to live their life by the way of the medicine wheel for a more balanced um, approach to life. And here it is in action. Uh, the colors will, the colors and their meanings will differ depending on what tribe or what tribal uh, area you're from. So it's not, it's not consistent among all nations.